Hello my besties and welcome to another reaction. Uh, this next song is brought to you by Gary Wright. It's called Really Want to Know You and it was requested for by Amma Drummond. Let's go check it out. <laughs> I love that. That sounds straight out of the 80s. Um, it's got like a, a big influence of a new wave. In fact, I, I'm going to call it a new wave, man. I, I really, really like that. You know, uh, I like those synthesizers. I like the keyboards. Uh, I like his voice. It's, it's got like a kind of like effect on it. Or maybe it hasn't. Maybe it's just his voice. I don't know. But it's got like a unique tone that I really, really like. Um, and it's got a catchy melody as well. This is nice stuff. Let's get some more. This really is a great song, guys, man. You know, I love the synthesized sound. As I said, uh, I love the Moog as well. Uh, the Moog is very, very beautiful here to me. You know, really captivated me. Uh, so many other sounds as well that I cannot say what they are. I'm sure the fair light was used in this song as well, you know, because there's just so much going on in it, you know, uh, and it's just, uh, it sounds very, very futuristic, especially if you listen to it back then when it came out in the 80s. I keep saying 80s. I'm not sure it's the 80s, but... I am sure it's the 80s. What I meant to say was, I don't know what year it is officially, but I'm sure it's the 80s. <laughs> I'll eat my hat if it's not from the 80s. Uh, it's a great song. I love it, Ben. Uh, let's get some more.
wanna know you I really wanna show you the way I feel I really wanna know you I really wanna show you the way I feel I really wanna know, know, know you I really wanna show, show, show you I really wanna know, know, know Yes, I wanna know Gary Wright really, really had me with this song, man. Um, I really enjoyed it, man. It's so catchy. Um, and musically, it's just fantastic. Um, I can imagine when this song came out back then, uh, people listening to the song and discovering all those beautiful sounds and thinking, wow, this is amazing. Uh, almost like what you, you were listening to in space. <laughs> but at the same time, it's catchy. It's also got catchy lyrics, you know, so... Um, all in all, it had all the attributes of a huge song. Um, I want to check something quickly. I want to know exactly what year this was released. I'm thinking 82, 83, that's my guess, you know, thereabouts. So uh, let's have a quick check, please. Okay, okay, okay. It was actually released in 1981. So I said 82, 83, so I was a year over. <laughs> And it got to number 16 in the U.S. Billboard charts. So it doesn't say about, about other parts of the world, but he did about, you know, about the U.S. So it was a big hit. You know, uh, if you had a top 20 song and, you know, and the Billboard charts, that's a big song. So it was a big song for him. Uh, I'm glad to know that. I would have been disappointed if it was like a number 40 or something, you know. But uh, great stuff. I enjoyed that very, very much. And I hope you guys did too. Um, if you did... Don't forget to give the video a like for me, uh, and I thank you for that in advance. Those who found the channel for the first time today, welcome on board and thank you for stopping by. Uh, I hope you enjoyed yourself enough to come back again. My name is Harry. Stay cool, stay safe, stay beautiful in your hearts and soul. Till next time, see you. Bye-bye.